to draw this in first angle projection i'm gonna draw my horizontal my vertical lines now the total length here okay look at this from this direction okay from this direction here so this direction of the arrow and let's get the total length right from this is 15 40 15 Okay, that is 15 plus 40, 55 plus 15, 70. Total length here is 70, which is 7 cm. So, my ruler, I'll measure 7 cm and mark. That's at this point here, okay? From, from here, I'm going up how many? 15. Me, I'm going up 1.5 cm, that is 15 millimeter, 1.5. Let me, then here also, this part here, I'm still going 15 up. 15 up now this part here okay the same thing as this part here 15 so i'm going from here i'm going 15 that is from here I'm going 1.5 and then from here it's i'm also going 1.5 then from here i'll bring it down from here i'll bring it down In orthographic projection, whatever that is in, whatever that is inside will tend to come towards the um outside and appear on one straight line. So this part here, okay, will be this part here. Okay, having done that, when I done, let's look at this part of it, okay? Now from here, which is this part here? From here, the height is 50, so I'll be going 5 cm. A mark at this height here i'm going towards the left for 30 millimeter okay so i'm going 3 cm that's 30. okay so i think that now i'll join here to this last line remember this thing now will tend to come towards this up part so that it looks like one plane so from here join to this line from here i'll join it down. Okay, I would want to have front view. Yes, I don't want to have front view. Now, one good thing about uh, orthographic projection is that once you, draw, once you draw the front view, elongate all your lines towards the side view and towards the top view, too. I'm elongating this, this line here, so I'm sorry, I'm going to elongate it. Now, elongate this and I'll elongate this. Okay, having done that, let's move over to the side view. Now, to draw the side view, what will I do? Now, this is the side view. Total length of the side view is 50. Okay, as total length. So, I'll mark 50 here. Okay, 15. That is from here to here, 15. Now, length here is 15, 15, and 52. So I need to measure 15 because I already elongated this line. So if you check, here is already 15. So I'll just join it up. And then close it. Okay. What else you guess in our side view? This line here. Okay, this line here. I have checked this line is in the center of this part. So I'll get the center here. This is 50. Center will be 25. 25. And the thickness of this line, this thickness here is 10. That is from half, 5, 5. So from this half here, I will go 0 0.5 and 0 0.5. Now, what is the length? The length will be the same length of this land. Same length of this land. I told you guys to elongate it. So I'll then draw it up. This way and draw it up this way and then I'll join it up. Now this part is also part of our this part is also part of our size view, but it will this part here will be blocking it, okay? So it looks like an invisible or a hidden dimension if I if I look at this from this part here. And in order to, to depict this, what do we do? We um we, we depict it with broken lines. This line here, this part here with broken lines to show that it's actually hidden. So the length here is 15, okay. Anything that has appearing here is also appearing here too. 
So I'll mark 15, 15, and here to 15. On this part now, I'll then draw broken lines. Now to draw the top view, I'll have to do some elongation, okay? So I'll be on the safe side. I'll place my ruler on this line with my 45 degree set square, placing it this way. From this center here, okay, I'll draw it down. Upon drawing down, I'll elongate all these my line streets. From the top, I will have this now looks like I, okay, this part here, this part here, and then this part, but it looks like one straight line. Now, first of all, let me draw the center, which is this one here. Now, from this part here, I will trace it. Are you seeing it? From this line here, as I'm here now, I will thicken it. Thicken it. Okay, then this is the second one here, and also taking it. And if you check, they actually did the same measurement though. Every time measuring. Now join here. Okay, and then join this part too. Okay, having done that, now remember there is a line here. At this part here, so with this line that I traced, I just draw this line. Okay. Now let's get this thing, this part here. This part is the talent here, which is talent. This part here, I'm on top of. Is this come down with 15? Already here is already 15, so I'll just. Draw it now. Go inside here to 15. Here's already 15. I'll just try to stop here. I'll come out here 40. Here's already 40. Can you see it? So I'll just take it now. Come out here 15 back. It's already 15. Now taking this many parts here. Okay. Now do the same thing because whatever that is there is still in this part too. So I'll just take in this part here. Basically, this is how the tree is of this block looks like. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in our next episode. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment for engaging content like this. Bye for now.